All right, we're moving forward into a car wash. They're gonna direct us up. It's a little hard to see. So they're gonna be spraying the car down. And then because there's sunlight and mist, you're gonna have to move forward. You're doing a great job. Nice job. So in the winter time, you need to wash your car more frequently because of the road salt. And that salt can damage your vehicle. So it's definitely harder to see. And uh, you know, we're gonna show you how to get through a car wash, what to do. See, that car is not on the track. They have to back up, and that's what's dangerous. Is that misty? Right, it is misty. So you're gonna be moving forward. They're gonna have you go forward. See the guy telling you move forward, go ahead and move forward. You're doing great. And go slow, have your foot on the brake, turn the wheel to the left, and just stop so you don't run over the guy. So he's using a brush to scrub that car, and you're getting off all that road salt and mist, and uh, washing your car weekly will make it beautiful. And of course, you need that. And then there's a conveyor belt that you'll have once you go through. So just be patient, and then someone will wave you forward. That guy. He's waving you forward. Keep your foot on the brake. Turn the wheel. You got to get on the track. Telling you to go to the left, brother. Hey, straighten up. There you go. Good. Good job. Now you're on the track. Excellent. Put in neutral. So in neutral, your motor and transmission, take your foot off the brake, brother. Your motor and transmission are disconnected. And it just rolls, right? yes, it just rolls. And then they're uh, spraying the car down, scrubbing it. And then when your car is nice, now he's gonna push a button. He just did. And you're gonna be moving forward on the conveyor belt in a moment. And a hey, we're moving through the conveyor belt. Uh, you don't even have to put your hands on the wheel, the conveyor belt. That's a common mistake that a lot of uh, beginning people make. Getting into a car wash, you want to turn the wheel and you're going to end up getting off the track. And that's when you damage your rims, you damage your car, and then there's the soak. A lot of people do have phobias in the car. Getting claustrophobic, it is kind of scary because you don't know what's outside. There are two schools of thought on the brushes. Some people say the brushes leave swirl marks. It depends on the car wash. These big brush, their cloths actually, they need to be changed uh, monthly to make sure you get maximum cleaning capability. So it is uh, really incredible. I wanted you to see this. But these also can damage your car, damage your mirror, damage your wipers. And the hot wash facility is not responsible. This is like the shower for the car where they're rinsing it off. In some places do use recycled water, other places use fresh water. Um, and now here's the actual dryer. Let's have your foot on the brake, go up behind that 
vehicle and try to get your car even, you're doing well. And because it's so cold, you see this eerie steam like a movie. Yeah. And then look at him, he'll tell you what to do. Good, put that boy in park. And then these gentlemen are gonna blow off the car. The car. And they're gonna wipe it down with clean rags. If you use dirty rags, you're going to leave streaks and marks. And a lot of us aren't professionals. We use dirty rags and that puts dirt back on your car. Yep, you already know. So they're cleaning off everything. And, uh, and when you clean off your car, um, it looks better. You feel better psychologically and emotionally. And it makes you really appreciate. So I recommend at least weekly or every couple of weeks, um, you know, get your car washed, get it cleaned. Um, and there's gonna be ice outside once you get out there. So you can see the gentleman lifting the wipers, cleaning it nice and neat, doing a great job. And that's what it's all about, so. Are we gonna switch after this or? Uh, no, got 10 minutes. Uh, so, doing a great job. And they'll open up the door. That. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Appreciate you. So then they'll open up the door and we're back out to the elements. Light up your window, brother. And put it in drive. Um, go down to the edge. This way, try to make you feel good. Clean that window. Good. And uh, go up and out, and then you'll make a right turn. Always look and be careful. That was a nice job. Thank you.